Good afternoon, everybody. I'm coming back with another TTM video for you guys today. So we have three more TTMs to share with you guys. Uh, excited to share these with you. There's a couple of uh, big names in here, including one Hall of Famer. And then I have uh, two purchases for the 1990 Donruss set that I'm going to share with you guys as we're inching our way closer and closer and closer. So with this being New Year's Day, um, I do have a couple goals I want to share with you guys before we get on with the... TTMs. Uh, goal number one is I hope that in 2023 I finish off the 1990 Donruss set. Have uh, uh, 68 to go. So uh, we're hoping we can knock out those 68 uh, this year. And along the way, we're going to get a lot of cards in the set authenticated so we can make sure that uh, the set is as authentic as possible. Um, another goal of mine is I would love, love to finish the 1987 Flare Basketball PSA 8 graded set. I'm about uh, 16 or 17 cards into that set. It's a 132 card set. So uh, we have about 100 and we'll call it 116 cards to go. Uh, as I'm focusing uh, on fewer and fewer cards for the 1990 Donruss set, I can kind of hone in and gear in on uh, the Fleer set. And then another goal of mine is to try and finish the 1960 Tops football set. I have about 60 cards to go into that one. And so hopefully by the end of 2023, uh, those three sets are complete, and then I could look at starting up uh, new projects. I'm also going to be trying to do the best I can on the 1970 Tops baseball set, uh, the binder set that I'm putting together, but uh, that one's kind of taking a uh, backseat to the other sets. Um, I'll pick them up as I can, but uh, all of the extra funds I have for cards are going to try to go to those those three sets uh in, in priority. So those are kind of my goals for this upcoming year. Um, hopefully I can, uh, can accomplish, uh, those goals, but, uh, you never know. You always run into bumps in the road and things change. So we will see how well we can do. Uh, but with that said, let's get on with the TTMs guys. These are some good TTMs. Uh, Hoping that uh, you guys will enjoy them. The first one that I'm going to share with you guys is a 2 out of 2 success in 30 days. It's coming from Las Vegas, Nevada. Uh, this person is a great TTMer. We were able to get back Mr. Bob Malacki. And so we got him on the 1989 score. And then we also got him on the 1992 score. Two nice returns for Mr. Malacky. Came out fantastic. Our next return is a two of two success in 30 days. It's coming out of Phoenix, Arizona. I've seen quite a few of you get this person back, so I finally broke down. I knew I had to get cards out to him. Uh, finally broke down and got them sent out. And that is Mr. Matt Williams. So we got Mr. Matt Williams on the 92 score. When he was with San Francisco. And then we got him on this. Uh, let me see. What year is this upper deck? It is a 2000, 2000 upper deck when he was with the Arizona Diamondbacks. Card came out nice. So glad to get Matt Williams back. Of course, he had a 90, 1990 Donruss card. Uh, I already have it for the set. So didn't want to send out another 90 Donruss. So we got him on a couple different cards. And our last return is a one of one success. Took six days coming from Santa Ana, California. Six days. This person was on it. And I was so glad to get this one back. If I can get it out of the envelope. We were able to get back Hall of Famer Jim Palmer. We got him on this 84 tops. And as you can see, he signed it for me and he also put the inscription Hall of Fame 90. I did ask him to put the inscription and he came through. I really appreciate it. Uh, first time I've ever sent out to Jim Palmer. Uh, it won't be the last, of course, but uh, six days was an amazing, amazing return. So thank you, Mr. Palmer. Add another Hall of Famer to the collection there. And this card came out great. You can see that there's a little bit of smear on the Hall of Fame 90 inscription. But the signature is perfect. So 
that is fine with me. So thank you, Mr. Palmer. So that is it for the TTMs. On to the purchases. These are two cards I picked up for the 1990 Donruss set. The first one we got is Mr. Greg Swindell with the Cleveland Indians. Of course, he had an uh, uh, MVP card. I already have the MVP card. Uh, and then he has the base card here. So I needed this for the set, and we picked it up. Uh, this one, I believe, cost $9 shipped. I want to say it was $9 shipped. So... Glad to get Mr. Swindell done for the 1990 Donruss set. And in our last pickup for the 90 Donruss set is Mr. John Smoltz. I needed him on the base card. And uh, I couldn't pass this up, guys. I got this for $10 shipped. And the reason I got it for $10 shipped is the signature isn't the greatest. And I'll do an up close for you here in a minute. Um, but looks spot on and, uh, I'll send it in to get authenticated. Uh, but for $10, I just, I couldn't pass it up to knock it out and you'll see why. So up close, you can see the skipping and almost like the smearing of the signature is almost like he signed it and then something sat on it and pulled up the signature. So it's not the greatest, like I said, but it's there. You can see the letters. And it was only $10, so I'm happy with it. Uh, I don't know if I'll upgrade down the line. He is kind of pricey on private signings. Uh, I want to say he's around the $70, $80 mark on private signings, but uh, you figure for $10 and at most into it for another $20 for, fee I'll, for fees, I'll be into it for $30, which is uh, more than half off of what it would be just to get it signed. So we will take it. We will be happy with it, and we will move on. So, anyways, guys, that is it for the video. Uh, had some great TTMs, like I said. Got got a couple nice pickups for the 1990 Donruss set. You guys got to let me know your thoughts, and let me know what your uh, your uh, goals for 2023 are with your collecting uh, uh, your collecting goals. And um, it'll be interesting to see what you guys have. But other than that, guys, that's all I got. So, as always, I hope you have a blessed evening. Until our next video, see ya.